If you observe an event at the atomic level, you change reality. How in the hell does this happen? Every time without fail. The experiment's called the double slit. No one's been able to figure out why. We think we have, and you can call us on it about five or 10 years from now if they prove it or not. Here's what we think is happening. You see, there's a recent theory about it all. Double slit involves a photon fired through two slits. If you watch it, it becomes a dot on the screen as it passes through two slits. If you look away, it becomes a wave every single time. How in the hell does that happen? Well, think about orc or is the theory from a guy named Penrose and an anesthesiologist. The mind is far more vast than we think. It's got tentacles going all the way from our area, our body of essence, all the way to a sea of information across the universe. And that's their theory. And these tentacles out of our mind is called microtubules, very tiny, but they go a long way. So when they connect with that information, it's not just connection. It is a collision, an impact. Think Monday Night Football, Lawrence Taylor, 1985. He sacks Joe Theismann, a ferocious hit. Play is over. Theismann's night is over. I think his career ended that night. That's the collision you have to think about when your mind observes that photon passing through the double slits. That explains why the observation aspect changes reality. Your mind extended collides with the event. No one's come up with this, by the way. This is me staying up late at night. Now, awareness is not passive. It's, it's important, right? Well, awareness too in other areas matters. So for human beings, if you know someone in distress, they need help. You can, of course, call 911 if they're in immediate danger, but if they need help, 988, they can get counseling resources. And for basic human needs, 211 for housing, food, heat, and shelter. I'm Andrew Hirshhorn.